We saw this video footage, uh, very uh, dramatic. Uh, what exactly happened last night and how serious were these demonstrations? Mm. Uh, last night, tens of thousands of protesters gathered in Bangkok to write letters addressed to King Mahavishar Alungan. It was the first time protesters attempted to directly communicate with the king and request monarchy reform. Um, the, the letters were put inside these containers designed to look like um, Thai post boxes, and there were wheels alongside demonstrators as they marched toward the Grand Palace to deliver their messages. Uh, but once the protesters got close to the palace, the police started using water cannons um, to let them know not to advance past the police line. Um, there were five injuries from that event last night. Um, the protest organizers then stopped their march and called off their gathering. Randy, we've seen these protests going on for weeks now with negotiations between the sides. So what's the sort of momentum at the moment? What's different this time? Last night's event was significant in that the protesters were essentially taking their movements to a new height after nearly four months since it began. Um, they're trying to communicate directly with the king, although those letters um, didn't get inside the palace last night. It's worth note noting that they, they tried. Um, each time they're doing these key events, they're changing the relationship between the people and the king bit by bit. Um, they're breaking taboos in Thailand where insulting or criticizing top royals can lead to long jail sentences. Um, they're making it more common to discuss the roles of the monarchy in the society. Yeah, exactly. So is this a turning point for how things are with the government and also for the movement? movement itself? Yeah, I, I think we could see a, a further escalation um, from this point. Um, and we have been seeing this escalating each month with, with each key event. Um, so far, the government has not been able to defuse the situation. Uh, last week, the parliament's plan to set up a con reconciliation committee uh, was rejected by the protesters who are set on seeing Prime Minister Prayut Chan-o-sha ousted immediately. Um, some political analysts note that last night's event was an attempt to divide the establishment. Um, it was an attempt to leverage the king's power to force Prayut out.